Hello all, welcome in this video session. Today's topic of discussion is vendor wise GRIR balance in SAP. Okay, how to find out the vendor wise GRIR balance in SAP. Okay, for this I have to use the transaction code. I have to use the transaction code MB5S. Getting my points? MB5S. Okay, let's use this transaction code MB5S. Okay. Uh, for this here need to vendor code. I am just uh, filling the vendor code. <coughs> 108648. Here you can in fill the multiple vendor code. Means you have lot of option. Either you co copy from Excel here. Okay. You can fill the multiple vendor code here. Getting my points. Or n number of multiple vendors okay are two vendors three vendors and all okay close down purchase organization what is the meaning of purchase organization either you have created the purchase order centralized or decentralized okay so generally we are uh, creating the purchase order decentralized okay i'm not filling the purchase group getting my points I'm not filling the purchase group here. Okay. Also, I'm not filling the material. If you have a material detail, then you can fill the material code here. Okay. Multiple material code here. Okay. So you will get the GRIL balance material wise purchasing document. If you have the purchase order list, you can fill your purchase order list here, purchase order number here. Then you will get the data of GRIR balance with respect to purchase order. Getting my points? This is item. What are the items? Okay. So you will get the data accordingly. Okay. <clears throat> For example, you have a purchase document, something like that. Then item 10, 20, 30, you can fill here. Okay. Here you have option to cleared items too. You will get the details of cleared item too. So I'm just clicking on this and just executing this transaction code. Okay. <clears throat> so this is the GRIR list of the GRIR balances okay what is the meaning of GRIR balance good receipt invoice receipt balances getting my points for example this is the purchase organization 2000 okay and this is the vendor code this is the vendor code okay with respect to this vendor code there are so many purchase orders available and for the different different good receipt amount okay this is the good receipt amount this is invoice amount what is the meaning of the invoice after the receiving of the vendor invoice the accounts department of the company will run the transaction code miro miro okay miro is the used for the <coughs> invoice verification and subsequently for the vendor payment once the miro will run then the grir balances will automatically go for the liability of the vendor okay for the payment liability of the vendor okay for example this is the purchase document number this is item number this is uh, receipt this is the invoice okay this is the good receipt value and this is the invoice value for example if you click on this purchase order if you click on this line item then you will get the details See, this is the good receipt document number, good receipt. This is the service entry sheet number. This is the service entry sheet number. Once this service entry sheet number approved by competent authority, then this material document number or the accounting document number posted and the GRIR, this amount is posted in the GRIR, okay? If I am clicking on this material document, <coughs> Subsequently, I'm um, just clicking on the document info and uh, click on the follow on the documents. This is the respective accounting document. This is the material document. This is the accounting document. Okay. So due to missing authorization, I am facing this problem. If you have authorization, then you can check this accounting documents too. Okay. So this is the invoice document. 
this is the Miro document. Okay, this is the service entry sheet document. Okay, this is respective material document. This is Miro document. The amount of the Miro is same 10753.25. This is the good receipt document. So once you click on any line item, then you will get the detail regard of this. You will see with respect to purchase order with respect to purchase order with respect to vendors code with there are so many purchase orders okay okay so many good receipt values for these purchase orders there is a nothing good receipt and nothing no miro is subsequently run okay see uh, this is the material purchase order fra2 j once db j dj okay jc v1 okay so these are the subsequent uh, transaction type with respect to purchase order for example if fra2 what is the meaning of fra2 the freight charges okay if you click on this <coughs> for example if you click on this see so these are the material document these are the good receipt document okay these are the delivery cost and all okay so <clears throat> you can check this record okay <clears throat> accordingly so <clears throat> we have to minimize the GRIR balances we have to minimize the GRIR balances after doing the Miro okay the concept of the purchase order is this the purchase order is made for the services or purchase order made for the materials okay stock is okay once stock is received then good receipt with respect to purchase order then material document or MIGO document is posted in the GRIR balances okay and from for that from that GRIR GL the after the running of the MIRO <coughs> GRIR balance will clear and that is post for the vendor payment or the vendor liability so in every company there should be uh, effort to minimize the GRIR balance okay so after the running of the SES or after the running of the MIGO good receipt you have to uh, make full effort to do the MIRO once the vendor has issued the invoice okay so this is the way this is the way you can get the detail of uh, the GRIR balances okay after the second way the accounts team will get the GRIR balance with respect to GL account uh, with respect to the GRIR GL here I am going to show the GRIR balance of uh, any vendor code any um, purchase order or any material dog okay with respect to materials what is the GRIR balance okay so thanks for watching this video okay this is the today's discussion to get the list of GRIR balance with respect to vendor with respect to purchase organization with respect to material with respect to POs okay so thanks for watching please like share subscribe have a nice day okay